Hey friends, so today we are going to be reading Uni the Unicorn, Uni's First Sleepover. This is one of the Step Into Reading books. It's by Amy Krause Rosenthal. All right, I hope you guys enjoy the book. Uni the Unicorn, Uni's First Sleepover, an Amy Krause Rosenthal book. Tonight is Uni's first sleepover. Uni cannot wait. Uni trots to the top of Sunny Hill. Goldie, Pinky, and Silky are already there. Let's play sparkle ball, says Goldie. I played it at my last sleepover. Goldie kicks the ball to Uni. Uni kicks it into the mud. Uni is out of the game. Uni does not mind. The sleepover is still fun. I can make colors when I run, Pinky says. I learned how at my last sleepover. Can you see what color Pinky makes when she runs? It's pink. I want to do that, says Uni. Pinky runs fast. She makes a pink streak. Uni runs fast too. Uni does not make a pink streak. Uni does not mind. The sleepover is still fun. They go to deep pond. I can kick a rock across the pond, Silky says. I did it at my last sleepover. Silky's rock flies like a bird over deep pond. It is Uni's turn. Uni's rock lands in the water. Uni is not having fun now. The sun sets. It is dark. The unicorns lie down on their blankets. Stars glow above. Then clouds cover the sky. The stars are gone. An owl hoots. It is very dark. Can you hoot like an owl? Hoo, hoo. Uni hears someone crying. What is wrong, Uni asks. The dark scares me, says Goldie. It scares us too, says Pinky and Silky. I know, says Uni. We can make a tent with our blankets to feel safe. The blanket tent helps, but the unicorns are still awake. So Uni tells a story. It is about the sparkling sun and a rainbow and birds flying across the sky. One by one, the unicorns close their eyes. Bright sun wakes them. It is a new day. You tell great stories, Uni, says Goldie. I cannot wait to hear more. Uni is happy. Uni is good at something too. Uni is excited for the next sleepover. Let's play sparkle ball, Uni says. The end.